Well, it is very important, of course, to be here because, you know, Egypt just uh, concluded the roadmap and by the conclusion of our roadmap, we had, you know, a new parliament in Egypt. We were so keen to come, even the public opinion in Egypt, you know, they are following us and they are so, you know, happy that Egypt again will be a member of the IPU and we are so glad, you know, that uh, tonight we will announce our uh, resumption of our membership in this uh, important and old organization because Egypt was an old member, one of the founders of the IPU, and I think we had uh, a lot of, uh, let us say, contribution to put the IPU in the right way. Well, uh, you know, if we have an organization, you know, to have all the, the parliaments in the world and Egypt knows uh, embark on a real democratic process, it means that Egypt should be an instrumental and member of, you know, this organization. And this organs, I think everybody is, uh, let us say, paying more attention to, uh, to it and its work. The meaning of the way we are now a member of this IPU, it means that there's a clear and significant, uh, significant recognition from everybody that Egypt was in the right way. And we already, you know, conclude our roadmap, which all of us are so proud to have it uh, again, uh, you know, uh, implemented in that way. For Egypt to be represented here at the IPU is, is to me as a young parliamentarian, um, a very natural process uh, because Egypt was a member, the third member since this institution, 1886. So it's very natural that we're back here, especially after all the, the reform and all the, the natural processes that, that occurred in Egypt now to make us a stronger, more efficient parliament. I, I was happy to take part in the two-day conference that happened before this uh, assembly uh, for the young parliamentarians. Um, Egypt um, undergone two major uh, constitutional changes and elections that allowed 178 people under 45 years old to be a member of the parliament, which has never happened before. Uh, people that are there for the first time with fresh ideas and they bring about change and it's natural for us to be back here. Um, the Egyptian youth uh, is the one that started all the change in Egypt. Youth in parliament and especially coming into parliament by elections is very important because uh, it proves that the, the country is, is motivated. It, the country is putting forward its best. It's more motivated, more educated uh, uh, subjects, as we might say, uh, to lead the future. Well, uh, being uh, uh, a part of the International Parliament Union, it's, it's, a, it's a great opportunity to Egypt to be back again to their proper position in, in this union, especially after the, the, the five years of freezing. Despite that Egypt was a fundamental and uh, active member with different posts in the, in the parliamentarian uh, union. And now what we are um, uh, delivering to people that Egypt now is having 2015 parliament, which is totally different with a, with a, a, a big, the biggest uh, number of representatives from uh, women, like 89, uh, 89 women in the parliament with the biggest number of, of youth representatives in the parliament. Egypt is uh, essential in the Middle East, as, uh, as uh, what we have said and all our colleagues uh, uh, mentioned before. Uh, in the Middle East, in the Arab area, in Africa, She's uh, uh, on the face of, of Africa. So uh, now Egypt is, is saying it is back to the, to the place it should be.